Okay, so we're gonna do a uh, basket hitch with our uh, two bales of hay. First thing I do before I take any ropes down or anything is check my cinch, tighten it up. Okay, once my cinch is good and ready to load, you take your ropes down. Throw your slack out the back of the animal so you're not stepping on them. Okay, extend your loop big enough to get around the hay bale or your pack. Alright, now you're, you're going to put your hay bale on there with the rain flap to the top and to the outside. Alright, take your bale up by the ropes. Sling it up there. Okay. You kind of hold this with your chest. And uh, start with the hard end of your rope that's tied off to the D's first. Start taking your slack out and put a loop around. Alright. You want to be about a third of the way down the bale when you're placing your rope. Alright. So I got my hard end. I'm placed in a third around. I grab my tail. Pull your slack out. Alright. Now I can hold this whole thing up here by just hanging on to my tail. And I can place that bail wherever I need it. You don't necessarily have to be hanging on to this whole thing until it's tied off. You can hang on to it like this and you can raise or lower it or fix it or whatever you need to do. Okay. That's about right where I want it. I'm going to suck this down, grab each side of the pack. Hang on to your tail end and pull, pull on your tail and kind of make a ratchet. Walk this pack back and forth. See that slack coming out of the, the rope? Okay, and what that's doing is sucking that bale down to the D's. Okay. After you're good and tight, take your tail end up, and your lash rope, put a loop through. All right, pull the loop onto the left side and kind of do a push and pull to tighten it up good. Reach through your loop and grab your tail. Okay, Want that's loop about called a packer's knot. This is called a packer's knot, yep. Yeah. And you don't want this loop too big hanging here or too small where it can slip out. About that is good. Okay, put a half hitch on it. 